Iwanja Hotan, um, gracias for your energies and imaginations these past few months. The first water is the body at Ganav. The Colorado River is the most endangered river in the United States. Also, it is a part of my body. I carry a river. It is who I am. Hamakav. This is not metaphor. When a Mojave says, we are saying our name. We are telling a story of our existence. The river runs through the middle of my body. I have said the word river in every stanza. I don't want to waste water. I must preserve the river in my body. In future stanzas, I will try to be more conservative. The Spanish called us Mojave. Colorado, the name they gave our river because it was silt red thick. Natives have been called red forever. I have never met a native who is red, not even on my reservation. I live in the desert along a damned blue river. The only red people I've seen are white tourists sunburned after staying on the water too long. Hamakav is the true name of our people, given to us by our creator, who loosed the river from the earth and built it into our living bodies. Translated into English, Hamakav means the river runs through the middle of our body the same way it runs through the middle of our land. This is a poor translation, like all translations. In American imaginations, the logic of this image will lend itself to surrealism, or magical realism. Americans prefer a magical red Indian or a shaman or a fake Indian in a red dress over a real native, even a real native carrying the dangerous and heavy blues of a river in her body. What threatens white people is often dismissed as myth. I have never been true in America. America is my myth. Gracias.